out your 209 tattoos, folks. Here he is, Nate Diaz, one of the biggest superstars in all of mixed martial arts. It's amazing to think where he could have taken his star power if he was in a regular cycle. Yes. Yes, if he fought as regular. Ready to fight. Ready. Good. So here is the inimitable Nate Diaz, more than 10 years on this UFC roster. And here's a guy who intimidates a lot of opponents. But quick entry to get Man, in on a single. That was a great single. What a high impact takedown that was. Good kick. All right, so he just decides to get up here and let the opponent up. Slips. Nice shot inside by the champion. And he comes through with a big knee. She might have gets the early takedown. That did not take long. Oh, man, I'm starting to feel bad for the canvas as he lands another takedown there. He landed another takedown, and he's doing it over and over again. What I am a massive fan of is his cardio, the ability to be able to keep this pace over and over as he hits these takedown attempts. Oh, big hook. That'll leave a mark. Well, now if you're the opponent, you really got to be careful as Diaz is able to find a home for that right hand yet again. When Diaz starts landing the right hand, you have got to stay firm. You have got to dig your heels in the ground and say, no way you're going to just run me over. Easier said than done when you're facing Nathan Diaz. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. So he needs to mix it up. He needs to start kicking more. Quick level change now. He went single into a high crotch. Oh, he's taking his dude for a ride. Oh! oh my God, he switched the lock to a high crotch, rotated him, and took him for a ride. That was a big takedown. Three punch. Diaz's nose is bleeding now. Yes, looks as though he got cut by one of those offerings from his opponent. Seconds to go in the opening round. Big punch from the clinch. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class. Hands up, chin down. Quick entry. He rotates the lock and throws him way through the air. What a massive takedown. Diaz gets back up again. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, it's stringing them together so effectively. Never throwing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. Diaz gets the takedown here late in the round. It's a strategy you see from a lot of high-level fighters to try to sway the judges late in the round. In a very close round, a takedown like that might be the difference. All right, 60 seconds between rounds. That gives us a chance to look at some of the replays from that previous. Ready to fight. Ready. Go All right, on. round two. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them should really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. All right, well, that blow is fauceting from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with a super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson red is nothing more than something that inspires him to continue doing what he's doing. So you have got to change something. You got to get your head moving so you're not taking too much damage to that cut. His opponent stayed upright. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Oh, my goodness. Left hook, right hand. Oh, huge left. All right, so an opportunity goes by the board to get him stuck. Back and forth we go. These two guys are trading huge shots. Diaz's nose is absolutely mangled at this stage of the fight. I'm no doctor, but I feel pretty convicted in saying that thing is definitely broken, and we might get a... Oh, 
He's in the world of trouble now. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. All right, so the ref is gonna step in here, yes, and call on the doctor to look at that nose job. Might need one after this <laughs> fight. He might, because his face looks so different. He's unrecognizable from yesterday. The blood has really become a problem for him. Not too much blood. The doctor taking a long look here, and it looks as though this fight will continue, at least for yep. now. Fans are gonna like that. That's really good. Ready good call fight. by the officials. All right, so the ringside position has made his way back. Oh, that's the finish of the thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Diaz's cut has really opened up now, folks. I don't necessarily have to tell you that watching at home. Looks like you could stick a quarter in there, and I'm not sure how much longer this fight is going to continue. Nice connection there by Nate Diaz. Not a guy you want to let get going here on the feet, DC. No, because it's all downhill with Nate, right? It's the activity that will overwhelm his opponents, and this looks like the start of that. All right, so the hands are crispy tonight. Not exactly what we thought we would see out of this wrestler, but as a former two-time U.S. Olympian yourself, with you some hands, you can fall in love with this. You can fall in love with the striking, but he is showing tonight that everything starts with the... Chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those type of things. Being told we've got some replays from the previous. You ready to fight? You ready? Go Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Kamza Chimaev gets caught with that punch. Oh, nice combination. Yeah. Oh, oh, he might get finished here. This is the biggest strike he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh. Diaz gets back up. decision is it. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at one minute, 20 seconds of round number three. Declare the winner by knockout and